Hey guys, I'm Flynn Fit and welcome to my Twitter today. I'm back with a redstone tutorial where today I'm going to be teaching you how to make a fire arrow launcher with using any three different wool blocks of your choice. Sandstone, redstone, redstone repeaters, one button, one lava bucket, a gate, pistons and a couple of stacks of arrows. So first off, we are going to be a, going to need the sandstone, and we are going to create a three by three square. So let's just find some nice flat land to do this. So let's just put this one, two, three, one, two, one, one, two, three. So there's our nice three by three square there. This probably wasn't the best place to put it, but you know. So next, we are going to place. A fence gate right here on top of this block here so we're just gonna do this and delete this block afterwards so this looks completely normal yes and then we are going to just put the lava behind it so you might want to be careful because the lava will come out behind it but before so you might want to add a dispenser at the back if you were me. So what we are going to do is we are going to get our dispenser, which I've got to get. I'm not stupid. Don't look at me like that. Our dispenser out the back of our inventory and fill it up with arrows. So let's just put the arrows in here. So let's just fill it right up here. So we've got 14 arrows in each. So that's good. Now we're going to put the lava here. And it's going to be staying there because of the fence the fence gate, not fence block, fence gate. And then we are going to add in lava sometimes be tricky. So make sure you put the lava behind the fence gate and aim for the spot marked on marked on the video. So next we are going to get to the this dispenser and use your first wool colour. I chose light blue to create a sort of it goes one two, and then one two I think it is no sorry it's one two here so sorry about that guys I just wasted some of your time so we are going to place one redstone repeater facing this way and one redstone repeater facing that way can you see that okay so make sure to face the dispenser when you're facing this when you're making that one and face the other way when you're making this one. So next you're going to add some green wool, some nice fancy green wool. If you chose green. I personally picked yellow. But you might want green. Actually no, I'm gonna use the green. Because what was the point of mentioning green wool if I'm not gonna use green? So you might want to do this. Then get one of these sticky pistons, place it down, place this one here, put that there, and you're going to have to make you guessed it. Two more redstone repeaters. Brilliant. So, so far we have used four redstone repeaters. So, next you are going to use your last final wool colour and create a sort of diagonal, if you will. So, and delete the ones underneath. So, after that, you are going to have to add a repeater here, so it's facing whatever block, whatever coloured wool block you put there. I'll just set it to day real quick. I knew that. <laughs> Time set day, and then you are going to want to put one of your dispensers. So you're going to want to do this, this, and then put a piston sorry not dispenser over here no nope, facing this way here yeah that's right so you just do that and then you just wire it all up with the redstone with the redstone so let's just put your redstone I think it's this is right isn't it yeah this is right sorry so you're going to have to get your redstone out of your inventory, 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 and then 
if you want to see what it looks like currently, you're going to have to put a redstone there as well. So we need to add our button now because I think it is complete. We have added the arrows, right? So let's test this. See, test for any mistakes. Let's just put all this in our inventory and see what it's like. Open the fence gate. And then you can just press the button again to stop it. So that was how you make a fire arrow launcher. So I'll just recap that. So first you add your 3x3 three three square of redstone blocks. Add your S-shaped blue box. Face one redstone repeater facing this way. And one redstone repeater facing that way. While adding your dispenser drawing it add your lava behind the fence gate and yeah that's basically it so i hope you enjoyed this tutorial guys if you enjoyed a uh, like is very much appreciated please subscribe and this is Avlon Wolf signing out